Right, this is a very brief little short follow-up video on the Solomon engine. Um, I definitely didn't like the twin flywheels that were borrowed off the Carey to stationary engine. And um, so now we've gone from uh, flywheel-wise, uh, from the sublime to the ridiculous. This is actually a Stuart 10V flywheel. Um, and no, I didn't go out and buy one. I actually I have a very old, appallingly badly made Stuart 10V that I'm attempting to... Uh, renovate and get running at the moment it's a long way off of that but um the flywheel um i realized was just ideal for it really i had to make a sleeve up because again the stuart uh crankshaft is much bigger than the more meccano crankshaft so we just made a I don't know, you can see that the, basically just a brass sleeve which uh, fits nicely inside that um and um, it looks a lot more how I envisaged the thing looking with the uh, Stuart flywheel. And it works quite ha quite happily with the Stuart flywheel. I've also cleaned up the um, cam and made that a lot prettier. Uh, and that, by the way, was simply a bog standard Meccano pulley, which has been filed down to produce the cam. So, uh, as I said, most of this was um, just uh, spare parts I had lying around, scrap bits of wood, etc. Um, obviously, <laughs> with the advent of the Stuart flywheel, um, that probably would cost you about 40 quid if you wanted to buy one on eBay. But <laughs> there you go, I actually have one lying around. So let's see it working. And it runs quite happily with the Stuart flywheel, but then again, it, 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 it's probably not quite as heavy as the two brass flywheels together, but it's pretty close. So you know, obviously, that's more than enough weight. There you go. I'm not quite sure how sight will run. Yeah, chunks are over quite slowly. So there you go, one cheap and cheerful solid engine. Thanks for watching.